Kids and gun violence quickly becoming the number one issue facing our families and our city. Whether it's from bullying or for fighting, firearms are replacing fistfights. You might be surprised to learn the issue hits home with a state representative who's had his own experience with the issue. Here's Rebecca Butcher. What's the reason that you had a child that felt like they needed to bring a gun to school and shoot another child. State Representative Antonio Parkinson is talking about the school shooting at the end of last month in Memphis. He knows there's likely another side to the story because he has once been the teen that was fed up with bullying. The child that is the perpetrator, the child that actually has the gun or that has shot another child, you know, they become the, the they get labeled rather as the the bad child in a lot of cases. Parkinson attempted to take matters into his own hands after he was bullied by four classmates at the age of 14. To this day, he's grateful another student stepped in to tell the principal. Thank God that he did tell because that not only saved the lives of probably four children, right, whose lives would have changed forever because I had intentions of shooting them as soon as this fight started. Parkinson says going to teachers and adults didn't help solve the problem between him and the group who wanted to fight him. In the office, I see all of the bullies and their parents, right? And all of them are in there crying. I mean, tears, right? Because now they're seeing what was about to happen to them. You realize how much of a coward they truly are, you know, and they have to run in packs in order to, to you know, to, you know, do the things that they're doing. Yeah, and Parkinson shared this situation was a turning point for him. Tune in tomorrow night at 10 for part two of his sit down with us on his advice to today's kids, the ones being bullied and the bullies themselves. And in the studio tonight, I'm Rebecca Butcher. So what if you're a parent concerned about bullying and gun violence? We've learned community forums are being held on that very topic every Saturday in October. This week's will be in Fraser at the Thomas Chapel Baptist Church on New Raleigh Road from 8.30 until 1 p.m. The event is free and lunch will be provided. They ask that you wear a mask. We've even set up a link if you'd like to register. Just go to abc24.com.